Well, without each churning out four-door practicality packed with performance, BMW can never really be far behind. Or uh, will it be ahead? Well, the BMW M6 Grand Coupe is a stylish four-door packed with luxury goodies and a snorting V8 under the hood. It churns out 552 bhp and 69.3 kgm of torque. Close enough to take on the competition. The BMW M cars are a lot of fun to drive and this one is the same. Um, it's a two-wheel, a rear-wheel drive car, so yes, it kind of uh, lets you slide and have a lot of fun. Um, uh, compared to the M5, uh, which I drove here last, was uh, this car gives you more confidence, it's more planted on the ground. Only thing I think it might be a little bit heavier than the other car, the M5. So, um, I mean, I really like everything on this car, Not nothing, no, no dislikes really. And um, it was quicker than the RS7 uh, as well by uh, over half a second, which is what we expected. And um, yeah, it, it feels really a uh, lot of confidence when you drive the car and it doesn't, it doesn't uh, catch you by surprise. So yeah, and the gearbox uh, on, on the sport uh, mode uh, uh, is, is, is quite fast on the upshift and the downshift. Um, so yeah, overall I like this car so far the best. When Narain felt a little disappointed by the RS7 in the way it transferred its weight around the corners, he came away smiling about the M6 Grand Coupe. And of course, the visuals will let you see why. This rear-wheel drive car was happy to get its tail out and allow Narain to have a little fun that he'd been missing out on. Even with all that action, he managed a 1 minute 59.45 second on the track.